Hey guys, how are you all doing? Um, I just wanted to share with you a quick uh, Hitman freelancer video today about uh, the New York Bank. And I think this is one of the best missions to do when you're first starting out because it gives you a lot of uh, money. However, uh, a lot of people uh, may not know how to do it fast, so I'm going to show you. Now, you probably won't have any items when you start because freelancer is very difficult. But ideally, you want to at least have a lockpick that will make your life a bit easier. But if you don't, no problem. Uh, pistol will also make it a bit easier. But we'll take off everything for this. And we're going to go on, on master difficulty as you saw there. Uh, rem remember that in the actual freelancer mode, the game is actually harder than master because you're going to be having a lot more um, enemies a lot more npcs uh, and more cameras but hopefully with this uh, walkthrough here i can show you how to do it fast so if your starting location is in the main building uh, main entrance you want to go left first for this wet towels uh, so wet floor sign and you're going to need to get frisk sir if you want to get through, I'm going to have to pad you down. Which is not a problem because you don't have any items, right? And this is well, assuming you have no sir. items at all. Alright. And the item you you need to, to, to do this whole bank Green robbery right. Go ahead, is sir. literally just the crowbar. That's the only item you need yeah. for the whole thing. So you go right up here to the left, pick it up, and that's it. Okay, you have a crowbar, you go back down towards the main entrance now. I'll show you a few things on the way. There'll be a lot of cameras in this area in Freelancer and as you're heading to the main entrance, if you want, you can go here and take this coin, which can help you. Main entrance, then go to the to the opposite side now. All right, here where these cops are, this is where you want to go down. Okay, in, in, in the actual game, uh, Freelancer, there's going to be a vendor waiting here for you, but there isn't any now. Run past. Go to the IT room here. Close the door behind you. And I break that door uh, with the crowbar. And then uh, probably deactivate this lock here. You're gonna wait for the guard to show up. Probably the best thing to do is take down this guard, right? Yeah, I think the IT guys can recognize you. I do a time takedown. Uh, probably take this disguise, it's going to be the one um, you, you use for the rest of the playthrough. Okay, turn this off for now, otherwise the other guy will come to investigate. Sorry, I forgot to grab the guy's keycard. Don't forget to grab his keycard. Let's go back through the vault using the keycard. You run past the main glass door here. There's going to be all these guys in there. It's okay to get caught by the camera. So you're going to break open this with your crowbar. Take the chloroform. Run straight into this room in the parking garage. Poison it with chloroform. There's going to be two guards here. They won't be able to see you, don't worry. In the main game, you're also going to have uh, a pickup there. Close this door behind you. And when you turn this on, all these guys will pass out. So there's going to be random NPCs walking um, in and out of this, of this uh, place. If they see the person knocked out, just leave the gas up. 
uh, as soon as they open the door and walk into this room, they'll get knocked out too. So you can just turn it on like that. And turn it off. Uh, we'll go ahead and watch that video I made um, of me just running through this mission with no uh, commentary. And you can see what I mean when an NPC shows up. There's an NPC which will just show up randomly. But as soon as he walks into the room, he gets knocked out. Now I'm trying to get the key here. I don't know if I picked it up already or not. Pick up all the security cards and stuff. Uh, you need to break the surveillance devices. In in this game, it's here, but in Freelancer, it's going to be over here. Right. Open this up. After you get the key, take this key card. Use it on here. Now, I advise against ever opening this door. Make sure this door is closed, okay? Always use this route even though in this mode you don't see any npcs there in the in freelancer there are going to be npcs we just come and stand at this window and so literally back to where we were hit this button and you open the box that's it that's how you do the bank robbery Now there's other starting locations. You can uh, end up starting Great work, here. You now have access to the vault. In the parking garage, here's the starting location. If you start here, just remember to run straight here and pick up this crowbar, and you can continue the rest of the steps um, like I showed. There's another starting location which is inside the main bank itself on the second floor. Uh, you just need to trace your steps to that first probe which I showed you and then you should be good to go. But anyway, once you've uh, activated the bank vault, go ahead and go in. You can turn off security. The most important thing you want to do is go straight to the main server here and you take... You're going to take the... In here it's the data core but in the actual um, freelancer it's going to be rewarding you with... Um, a lot of money like five to ten thousand um, gold usually highest i got was i think nine thousand so it's random each time but make sure you do that and then you want to go to this room on the right and there's going to be some coins uh i forgot it's, whether it's either here or here they're going to be coins make sure you take each one of those they're worth about 1500 um, gold each that's it, that's how you do the bank robbery. Sorry it got a bit messy there, but in the actual game you wouldn't be shooting, but 